top of this beautiful Sunday morning. So now my people, you are welcome to another episode of RC Day Hot. This paper headline for today will be the 24th day in the month of April 2022. Hmm. Happy New with my people. We will start from the Leadership Sunday this morning. If you never subscribe to my channel, I beg click on the subscribe button. And if you be, if you not be returning subscriber, you are welcome back. Thank you so much for the support this channel, to the support this dream, and to the support this vision. Hmm. My people, plenty for me today on top news today, and we go even snatch some from yesterday's newspaper. Market shots in Oyo as Alafi, then don't lay to rest. Everybody knows Alafi, he died a few hours ago. Crisis over PDP Northern Consensus candidate deepens. They talk say, now diversity gang up, uh, not binding on me. Now article, now he talk. And uh, some other people, let like me do talk say, is mere opinion of the traitors, not but injurious. Now, another headline we're go find there be Lagos government reopens Queensland school, says resumption date is sacrosanct. And uh, again, Nassau and SSANU extend strike by one month. Over 100 killed in Egbema illegal refinery fire. More information, we could not grab the leadership newspaper this Sunday morning. Moving on to Sunday Independence newspaper this morning, acute food shortage. 19.5 million Ni- Nigerians and children don't die at risk. End of an era. Buhari, OBJ, and other governors pay tribute to late Alafi Adeyemi. A bear community don't count losses over rainstorm. Now, from page 7 of the daily uh, Sunday Independence newspaper, we'll go find that information this morning. Then talk say 100 people they roasted by the pipeline explosion in Miva and Rimo community. Crisis brew in PDP over consensus uh, failure. And confronting APC audio stench at the most headache. Now, for P3 of the Sunday Independence New Paper, we're going find that information this morning. We can don't come and talk, say PDP if it ceases to exist if it loses 2023 presidential poll. And the uh, Abe kicks as Tony Cole emerges reverse APC gubernatorial candidate. All these juicy stories, we could not grab the Sunday Independence New Paper this morning. Moving on straight to the Sunday Telegraph newspaper, after 52 years reign, Alaf enjoys his ancestors at 83. Then don't talk to Buhari, Makide, Olubadon, Kalu, Tinubu, Afeni Ferry, and others don't pay tributes. About 2023 consensus break Northern PDP, and then talk say Atiku and Tabua took them out, then talk say you know they party to it. And Lamido talk say the position of Northern leaders, they injurious. If you want more information concerning that uh, matter, we could grab the Sunday Telegraph this morning for page 2. Illegal bunkering. Explosion kills over 100 people in Imo State. Governor don't declare the owner of the refinery wanted. As 12 houses and uh, 12 killed and houses burnt in another headers attack in Benue State. Tinubu Umayi Mohammed attend Aisha Buhari's iftar. Federal government fails to release the MK Katrina two months after the $2 million bond judgment. For more information, grab the Sunday Telegraph newspaper. Oil cyber attack. Indian police claims Russian malware planted from Nigeria. Now report na in Tokam. Ahmed talks a federal government to issue $950 million bond. Moving on straight to this day newspaper this morning, 2023. Under pressure, Jonathan Hint at contesting says supporters to watch out. And uh, this one now for information from uh, this day newspaper yesterday. War against terrorists. British military don't train more than 50 Nigerian special forces called Panthers and don't, they don't set for, impl- for redeployment. And custom don't approve reopening of four additional border posts. If you want more information concerning this matter, make una grab this day newspaper. Another headline na go find there be Oshibaja takes campaign to Ibadan or beats about becoming next president. My people, my people, now wait till I get for now. So the hot newspaper headline for today will be the 24th day in the month of April 2022. Be this. Till I see you in my next episode of Headline News, Energies and Gossip. Ensure say you day safe. Ensure say you day good. And put a smile on somebody's face. Because that's what not the hallmark of our existence. Till I see you tomorrow, my people. Have a beautiful Sunday. God bless Nigeria. Bye-bye for now.